Hey, it's Tony talking car biz. Look what I found. This is a gorgeous 2020 Toyota Tundra Crew Max short bed TRD Pro. Man, what a great looking truck. Four wheel drive, 5.7 liter V8. Hard to come by, but the best of the best for Toyota Tundras. If you're gonna go off road, this is the one to have. So in this video, I'm just gonna fly through this truck, give you a quick overview, show you some of the features, show you some of the things such as these cool floor mats, these awesome black leather TRD Pro seats. I wanna show you what makes a TRD Pro the Toyota Tundra that you should be considering in your next full-size pickup. Wow, what a great looking truck. Hey, let's go ahead and get started and see what we can find. Oh, okay, let's start up front and let's begin with these huge LED headlights and LED driving lights, crystal clear lenses, super bright white, the right headlight for this truck for sure. But then the TRD Pro comes standard with these rigid industry LED fog lights. So if you wanna have the right lighting package for off-road, this is the way to go. Moving around to the grill, the grill is kind of a semi-gloss finish, and this is the only vehicle you can get this grill on, and that's the TRD Edition with the large Toyota lettering across the front. Super bold, looks really awesome on this truck. There's a couple of pseudo or faux um, cutouts in the grill right here. So a faux hood scoop here, as well as up here on the top. Those do not go into the engine. They're just cosmetic, but they sure look great on this truck, that's for sure. Also, you'll notice the bumper, lower part of the bumper is that black matte finish, composite finish, and that's pretty durable. It's gonna help protect against scratches and dents and dings for your light off-road driving. Let's take a quick look underneath and we'll discover tow hooks right here and there. And then you'll also notice that huge TRD aluminum skid plate to provide extra protection underneath. And here's a quick look at the suspension on this side. We'll dive in and take a closer look as we walk around the vehicle. But a huge front end, beautiful, very aggressive. That black looks awesome. There's a panel right here, which you might have seen. That contains a bunch of sensors that work with your 2.0. Um, safety sense 2.0 and then those sensors right there also work with the sensor box up in the wind window or windshield there and that uh, helps with your dynamic cruise control pedestrian detection lots of great features in, in terms of safety there so heading around to the side of the truck let's take a look at the tire and the wheel package these wheels right here are, are exclusive for the TRD Pro. They're an 18 inch BBS forged aluminum wheel with the TRD branding on there. It's a matte black finish. And those are wrapped with a 275 65R 18 inch Michelin tire, which is a very good off-road tire, but also will feel good and handle good out on the road. Factory mud guards on this one, and then here's a quick look at your suspension. See if I can slide in there and give you a quick look. So there's your TRD red coil springs with your heavy duty suspension up front. Really a great suspension system and those red coil springs really pop out. Now you'll also notice we have the blacked out TRD or Tundra badging and the iForce 5.7 V8 badging is blacked out. Your mirrors have composite finish on the lower part, which is extra durable, painted black on the upper part, and then these mirrors do collapse. So if you are gonna do some off-road driving, you might wanna fold them in to prevent damage. But then they also fold the other way in case somebody clips it with a bicycle or a grocery cart or what have you. So just thinking about the practical side of those mirrors. Composite uh, door handles, matte black finish, very durable. The back windows are tinted, and this is the Crew Max, so that's uh, four full doors on there. Plenty of room, easy to get in and out 
with your equipment, your tools, your passengers. The other thing I really like about the TRD Pro is the fact that the TRD Pro is stamped right into the bed of the truck. Really great touch on there. There's your uh, mud guards in the back. Here's your red TRD shocks for your back as well. And then the TRD Pro exhaust. This is a dual exhaust, so that's kind of a black chrome finish. And it sounds awesome. Come on by, we'll fire it up so you can hear what it sounds like. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at the rear of the truck and see what we can find there. So at the rear of the truck, I wanna start with the uh, cargo light up on the top there. That's an extra feature, but it really is a must have. That rear window is tinted and it also goes up power up and down. So I'll show you the switch for that later. And then this one has the uh, optional uh, Tundra spray-in bed liner from the factory. And uh, the great thing about that is it does come under the factory warranty. And then you'll notice we have over the lip protection for your bed. And we do have the bed rail system, which provides for additional tie down points. Right here on the tailgate is your backup camera. Notice it's a locking tailgate. So if you get a tonneau cover, you're gonna be able to lock your stuff up pretty securely underneath there. And then we have Tundra stamped right into the back of the bed. And this has the blackout package. So you've got black Tundra letting, lettering applied on the inside of it. It's kind of a 3D effect. You can get these letters in black or chrome. And of course, this is the black version of that. Your tailgate is a slow down tailgate. So nice and easy, it doesn't slam around. It just comes down by itself. And you can see that bed liner is the skid proof. So it's got a texture to it, so stuff doesn't slide around quite as easy. And then tie down hooks in the corners throughout the entire bed. So really well thought out bed setup on the Tundra. And now let's move down to the bumper. Take a look at your trailer towing capabilities. So the bumper is a step bumper and it's got a, a bit of a texture on it so you don't slip and slide. It is a lighted bumper. Four pin wiring is already done and this does have the trailer braking set up as well. Here's your uh, receiver hitch for your trailer package. Um, if you, if you uh, put your own slide in hitch there, you'll be good to go, no problem. And then up underneath is where you're gonna find that full size spare tire right there. And here's a quick look at your Tundra suspension with your leaf springs and your dual exhaust coming out under the back as well. And you can just get a look at that Fox shock over on that side right there. Those are some awesome shocks. You'll sure appreciate those when you go off road. Okay, diving into the uh, back seat, stopping on the door. This is a full size door, so it really opens up wide. You'll have no problem getting your passengers and your cargo in and out of there for sure. Uh, a couple things, bottle holders down on the doors right here. And then this has the JBL audio system, which has 12 speakers. So there's one here and one here in each of the back doors for a total of four in the back seat. A silver door handle here that matches this trim right here. And we'll see more of it up front. But here we're starting to see the uh, red stitching as part of the TRD leather seats. So your back seats are full leather with the red stitching um folding armrest right here in the center plenty of room for the big mugs and then if you bring that up you can see it gives you a ton of space for adults no problem getting three adults in the back seat of this the back seats do fold up so this is 60 percent take the handle right here one-handed and boom there it goes take a look at how much space is there too Right here in this package are your tie-down hooks that work in the back for the rail system. So those just dial right in and then you can tie, tie your items down, your motorcycles or what have you. Um, in the center there's vents for your backseat passengers and a 12 volt outlet right there. There's a map pocket on the back of the passenger seat. And then there's assist grips up there. There's rear seat airbags as well, curtain airbags but no pocket on the back of this seat right here. 
and then to take the seat back down you just go like that pretty easy easiest easiest seat to fold down in the tundra lineup that's for sure so here's a quick look at the driver's compartment from the back seat nice stadium style seatings here so the back seats actually sit up a little bit higher than the front so you can see out the window really well from the back seat okay let's head inside and see what we can find in the driver's compartment so going and taking a look at the door first just a couple things here there's bottle holders on the doors map pockets your JBL speakers are here and here and then one thing here the power windows on the front driver front passenger they're automatic up and down but the back ones are not automatic so just be aware of that here's a quick look at your seat so your driver's seat uh, and the passenger seat is the full 10-way power seat with the power lumbar support and then they're also the leather with the red contrast stitching and then the TRD Pro is, is embroidered into the back of the seat. Now on the uh, Tacoma, it's actually in the headrest. Uh, so it's a little bit different between the two of them. Down on the lower part of the dash right here, there's uh, six switches, power mirror controls, overhead light controls. This switch right here is the manual lever leveling for your headlights. So the way that works is if you're towing something heavy or you've got your cargo down in the back, a lot of times your headlights will start to point up toward the sky. So you can adjust or re-level those headlights so they point straight down the road the way you want them to. This is your on off switch for your cargo light, your high beam on and off. So we have automatic high beams. And then this is the switch for that back window that I showed you before. So the way back window there, you open it up and close it with that switch down on the um, lower part of the dashboard. Parking brake, brake and accelerator pedal. And then the TRD Pro does come with these all weather TRD Pro branded floor mats. And then the door sill has a uh, Tundra embedded right in the door sill protector. Let's go ahead and jump in the seat and see what we can find. Okay, in the driver's compartment, we'll start here on the steering wheel. It's the four-spoke steering wheel, and it's uh, leather-wrapped. It's pretty thick, though, and there's some thumb rest right here. The leather feels nice. It's about the same quality as the seat. So on this side are controls for your sound system, your voice activation, your Bluetooth connectivity for your smartphone. There's a driver's side airbag, Toyota badge right there in chrome. On this side are controls for your information center. So there's a bunch of information right here in this center information center. And by using the switch on the steering wheel, you can toggle through that information for your compass, your fuel economy. And there's also some controls in there for, um, for your safety sense setup as well. So all your vehicle sensing, lane departure, uh, pre-collision, all that type of stuff is controlled or uh, viewed by using the controls right here. Here's your dynamic radar cruise control sensitivity settings, uh, lane departure settings, and then your actual cruise control is down here. Up a, a little bit higher, these are your wiper controls, your washer wiper controls, and then on this side is where the headlight controls are, including the on-off for your fog lights are right there as well. And then we'll take a quick look at these gauges. We've got um, kind of a white on black gauge cluster. So here's your tachometer, here's your speedometer. And then on the Tundra, you get the oil pressure gauge, you get your battery um, meter, you get a gas gauge, and then also the uh, engine uh, temperature gauge all right here. And then in the center is where you find your, out, you know, your outside temperature, your tachometer, um, your trip meter and all that type of stuff so a pretty aggressive full complement of gauges on the tundra moving over to your center stack i'll move quickly down here just a couple uh, features down here to highlight get some lighting down there a push button start tow haul capabilities and then your trailer um, 
settings are right here as well. So as I mentioned earlier, it has a trailer towing package standard. So that's where you're going to be able to do your settings for your trailer brakes if you have trailer brakes, that type of thing. Um, the center stack itself, this is an 8-inch touchscreen. It's the JBL audio system, so a really great sound system. 12 speakers, as I mentioned before. I've got it turned off right now. Let me go ahead and just switch it on. And I actually have the display turned off so that I didn't get a kickback on the reflection, but I'm gonna go ahead and bring that back on so you guys can see what it looks like. So there's your display. Now if I go to home, I've got the uh, radio settings here and here's my navigation. And if I tap on that, then I've got dynamic navigation, touchscreen, points of interest, all that type of stuff. Um, we also have Sirius XM satellite radio, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, all those buzzwords are now standard on the Tundra. Um, down here, automatic temperature control for driver front passenger, reads Tundra right across here. Um, then further down, this is where we've got our heated seat controls. This is for the front seats only. There's no heated seats in the back seat. Go ahead and shift it in gear and then get way down here. I want to show you the power ports because that seems to be important to people. So you've got a whole bunch of different places you can plug in your electronic devices. And then this is your traction control off. And then you also have a traditional 12 volt power port there. There's a small storage compartment here. Great place to throw your keys, your glasses, your phone, what have you. There's a cup holder here. And then as I pull back, you'll see there's two more of them right here in the center stack or center console as well here and here. Nice piece of chrome trim going around here. And then that silver trim here. And then I really like the shifter on this. It's a TRD branded shifter. It's wrapped with that silver finish and it's very comfortable. You can see it has the red stitching right here. So a really nice firm grip and a good style for that. There's a storage compartment right here where you can throw your uh, books or what have you. Another storage uh, shelf right here for your pocket change. And then as we turn to the armrest, you can see it's got the TRD brand here. There's a nice place to drop your phone. There's no wireless charging in the Tundra. I think it's kind of a miss, but um, it's not on here, so just you should know that. Here's your under, under your armrest. Huge place to put all your stuff and another 12 volt charger or power port, I should say. And then over here on the back, there's a place for your ink pens, your papers, your pads, uh, Kleenexes, what have you, can all be stored right underneath the armrest. Here's a quick look at that passenger seat with the red stitching and the embroidery. You can see the red stitching runs across the dashboard and into the armrest and the door as well. You have a locking glove box and it's a nice big glove box and of course we're going to give you all your owner's manuals and then in that plastic bag over there is the key to lock your wheels so your wheels don't get stolen. And you can see there's speakers for the JBL audio system down there as well speaker up here in the door and you've got front airbags you've got side curtain airbags passenger assist grips adjustable seat belts here's your overhead visor with the vanity mirrors and this does slide up and out so it's not an extension it's a sliding style place here to, to put your papers if you have papers and such overhead dome lights power switches for your power sliding moonroof which is right here which also tilts and then it does have a visor that can be closed as well. Safety connect is right here. So that's how you get help when you, if you get stuck or have a problem out on the road. And then a place here for your sunglasses. And then finally we have a, an automatic dimming rear view mirror and you can see it does have home link so you can pro program your garage door openers in there as well. And then last but not least, there's a storage compartment right here, just a place to throw your stuff. You can see it's got a, a plastic or a rubber liner so that can be washed. And there's another speaker up here, part of the JBL audio system. So let's go ahead and jump out, take a look under the hood, and wrap her up. Okay, let's uh, dive under the hood, take a look at what we have. So this is a 5.7 liter V8 
32 valves and it produces uh, 381 horsepower. So we've got a heavy duty battery, heavy duty alternator. This vehicle is set up good to go to tow. Now the warranty on the engine and the transmission is a five year, 60,000 mile setup. The uh, warranty on the vehicle itself is a three year, uh, 36,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty. And then every Toyota comes with Toyota Care, which covers your basic maintenance. So your oil changes, your fluid top offs, um, your tire rotation, everything's covered for two years or 25,000 miles with no deductible. So a really great warranty package on, I think you would agree, one of the best trucks in the market. So there you go. That's a brand new 2020 Toyota Tundra Crew Max TRD Pro, short bed, four wheel drive, 5.7 liter V8, the top of the line in the uh, Tundra setup. And this is a gorgeous truck, black on black. Boy, if you liked my video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. If you want more videos like this, please uh, subscribe to my channel. And then if you want a more detailed video on this truck, Maybe you want to know more about those wheels. Uh, let me know in the comments. And if I can get it done for you, I sure will. This is Tony Talking Car Biz. Thanks for watching.